First, take Snazaroo Metallic Gold and use a sponge to apply this right between the eyebrows and extend the shape up into a V. And then also add a very small amount on the outside edges of the eyes. Next, switch over to Snazaroo Metallic Copper and apply this right next to the gold. Use a sponge to blend the two colours together so there's no harsh edges. For the final base colour, take Snazaroo Electric Purple and use this to fill in the gap between the copper. Now you can of course use any colour combination for this design, it will all work, just experiment with it until you find something that you like. I then just added slightly more copper underneath the eyes to bring the mask shape round. For the lines, take Snazaroo Black and begin by painting three teardrops right in the middle of the mask. Then add another group of three teardrops, this time starting high above the eyebrow and extending down towards the middle. And then for a bit more detail, add a small curl on the largest teardrop. Add in a curl which extends right from the outside edge of the eye, up and round, and then finish off the bottom of the mask with even more teardrops. If you find that your lines are a little bit see-through and patchy, you can always go over the top with a second layer to darken things up. Use the gold paint to add in a few random dots on the purple section of the mask. And then use the purple to add even more dots here and there. And you can then finish everything off with a nice bit of purple lipstick. And the lovely thing about this metallic colour is it looks really shiny in the light. <laughs>